This is an instructional video detailing the applications and functions of the Phase 2 DVM-1000 vibration meter. The DVM-1000 is designed to obtain balance and alignment data on all types of rotating or moving objects. The technology incorporated utilizes a piezoelectric sensor to obtain sensitive and accurate readings. Let's move to the operation of the vibration meter and see how easy it is to utilize the different functions, taking tests, and obtaining results. To begin, attach the accelerometer probe to the meter. Press the power key to start and bring up the interface screen. Pressing the function button, you can toggle between the different vibration parameters. The three main measurement parameters are velocity, the most commonly used parameter, acceleration, which has excellent high frequency capabilities and is good for checking bearings or gear drives, and displacement, which is good for low frequency checking and low speed machinery, not bearings. Press the inch metric button, allows you to toggle back and forth. You will notice the change on the top right of the screen. The hold button allows the operator to hold the latest reading. The volume button adjusts the volume if you decide to use the tester as an audible receiver to listen to the vibration movement of the part you are checking. To take a reading, place the accelerometer firmly on the surface of the part being checked. You will notice the readings shown on the screen. You may choose to affix the accelerometer to the surface using the magnet, or you may also choose a tighter point of reference using the stinger probe supplied. Don't forget that readings in more than one vibration parameter can reveal more of the nature of the vibration signal. The supplied vibration chart in the manual should be used to gauge machine conditions. Changes in machine condition over time become readily apparent and permit repairs prior to machine failure. This concludes our application function guide for the Phase 2 DVM-1000 vibration meter.